The first pot shop in Stevens County is open for business. It's located right off the intersection of 395 and Williams Valley Road in Clayton. KXLY Force Katie Curry is working for you with details on the family owned business. The owners of Savage THC are relieved to finally open their doors. These first time business owners say they are optimistic about the future. They have poured every last dime into this business. Now the Decays are excited to finally welcome in customers. It was stressful not being able to open with those guys a month ago, you know, because I wanted to be on the first. Where many other pot stores around Spokane have investors, Scott Decay and his wife are doing it all on their own. He's a former concrete laborer. She was a cake decorator. The business side has just been the tough side for me. This is my really my first business. But together, they see success. And with the most recent numbers, there's no reason they shouldn't. As of August 21st, marijuana sales have generated over $6.5 million statewide. But more than anything, Decay's excited to be a part of history. It is a really big deal. And, you know, we try, we, were, we couldn't even celebrate, you know, until now. And now we can really relax and say, you know, we did it. And we are... Pioneers. Since the tax rate is lower in Stevens County, he's able to lower prices a dollar less than Spokane retailers. Decay says he's hoping the price and his location will track customers from surrounding rural areas as well as passersby. 15,000 cars go by every single day, so I mean that's a built-in plus. Decay says long term he hopes he's able to open at least three more stores. And with the support he's already seen from the community, he doesn't think that will be a problem. They want me here, it seems like. I think I think it's going to be good. As of now, Savage THC is open noon to 8, excluding Mondays, but they say they are looking at extending hours depending on demand. Reporting in Clayton, Katie Curry, KXOI 4 News.